ですね。さあ、パワーボール。倒れ込み式。2で返した完全に上がった叩きつけるカウントが入る2で返そう体が跳ねたスライディングラリアットカウントは2で返したカウントは2で返したカウントは2で返したいやあ美味しい Hi fans, Your NJPWWorld.com post game show from night one of the New Japan Cup. We're here at Corican Hall. They are tearing down and getting ready to move the production on because the New Japan Cup has just gotten started. What a way to kick off night one. We had two first round matchups tonight, and if you missed them live, my advice to you is make sure you check out the replay. The whole night was a ton of fun here at Corican Hall. Now, of course, we know Don Callis will be back with us. For the finals on the 21st, but over the course of the tournament, when we have English commentary, I'm going to have some guests. Tonight, my guest was Chucky T, who I thought did a great job and、uh, brought some really great analysis、uh, to the commentary booth. Now, if you didn't see the event live and you want to avoid some spoilers, you might want to turn this off now because we're going to talk about the results of everything that happened here tonight at Cork and Hall. All right. So here's what happened. We know advancing into the quarterfinals are Juice Robinson and Unbreakable Michael Elgin. Big Mike defeated Toma Hiroishi in an unbelievable 30 minute main event. You have to see it. Man, it was great. What a matchup. Two mirror images of each other doing almost the exact same moveset to one another the entire matchup. But it was Elgin in the end coming out on top. Now, we did see Tomohiro Ishii in the tail end of that match, the closing moments of that match, a scary maneuver out of the corner. He is being evaluated by medical personnel right now, but the preliminary word is is that Tomohiro Ishii will be fine, suffered no injury as a result of that match. So it is remarkable. What a physical encounter that was. But the same could be said for our semifinal tonight. Where Juice Robinson outlasted Yujiro Takahashi. And you heard the words of Juice. He came over to our broadcast desk and he said, That'll be the last time I overlook Yujiro Takahashi. Juice had already punched his ticket to the second round before even the bell rang. Yujiro had a lot of answers for Juice, but in the end, Robinson was able to recover. So we had two incredible matchups to get started. With our New Japan Cup for 2018. And there are still 14 competitors yet to even go. Starting with the tournament, the three main competitors that had everybody's focus were Hiroshi Tanahashi, Kota Ibushi, and Tetsuya Naito. Each for different reasons. Tanahashi coming back for his first match since suffering knee injuries at the hands of Minoru Suzuki and having to take time off since the end of January. Would Hiroshi Tanahashi, will Hiroshi Tanahashi be able to overcome the hex of three first round exits in a row? Will the knee injuries, will the bicep tear, will the culmination of、uh, so many years of injuries be too much for him to come out on top in 2018? Or Kota Ibushi, who has never tasted defeat in the, the New Japan Cup, he ran the table and won his first one in 2015. Can he duplicate the same feat this year? We'll have to wait and see. And Tetsuya Naito is going to have his hands full for sure with his first round opponent. Now, that's Zack Sabre Jr. from Suzuki Gun. Tetsuya Naito will face Zack Sabre Jr. on Sunday, and Kota Ibushi will tangle with Yoshihashi on Sunday. But there will be New Japan Cup action tomorrow as well. Bad Luck Fale will face Lance Archer. And、uh, there will be another first round matchup as well. But that escapes me right now. If you want to know the lineup, go to njpw1972.com. Oh, it's Taichi and Tanahashi tomorrow. That's our other one. So that's our two matchups tomorrow Fale and Archer, Tanahashi and Taichi. So what's going to happen in that? What's going to happen in the rest of the tournament? You have to tune in to find out. Now, we will be back and you'll be able to see the entire tournament at njpwworld.com. We'll be back with English commentary on the 15th, the second night of the quarterfinals, right back here in Cork and Hall, and we'll take you the rest of the way through.
This is going to be a tremendous tournament, fans. It's single elimination, and we know the winner will have their choice. They'll choose the never open weight champion, Hiroki Goto, the intercontinental champion, Minoru Suzuki, or the IWGP heavyweight champion, Kazuchika Okada, as the champion they will face. That's the prize you get for winning the New Japan Cup. Who will it be? Who will survive? Who will win this year's New Japan Cup? You're in the right place right here, njpwworld.com. I want to say goodnight here from Cork and Hall. We'll have action tomorrow for times and lineups, njpwworld.com, and you still have time to sign up if you have yet to do it. Never too late to subscribe to the best pro wrestling in the world. This is King of Sports Streaming, njpwworld.com. We say goodnight from Cork and Hall. I'm Kevin Kelly, and we'll see you back with English commentary on the 15th.